Hey guys, welcome to Let's Play My Candy Love. Um, this is going to be Nathaniel's version. So because people wanted like Nathaniel, but they couldn't just get him on the tape. So that's why I'm doing this for you guys. And as you can see, the internet is pretty acting pretty stupid, so I had to reload it every time. So yeah, that was a bit of awkward stuff. So. And as you can see, today's Saturday, and <clears throat> sorry about that. Um, and on Saturday, I'm going every Saturday. I'm gonna upload every video. So yeah, let's get started. It. <coughs> sorry, you guys. I'm so throat. Okay. Um, let's begin with the action points or APs. They allowed you to perform different types of action from getting one place to another. Sorry for shaking the camera because some somehow I'm just shaking it. Okay, you can see at the number of the APs on top of your screen. 10 APs are awarded each day when you log on. If you're out of APs, you have to wait till the following day or take a trip to the bank. So as you can see, you need to really save your um, APs. So don't use their APs, don't go too fast. Go slow to slow. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. Okay. Great, let's try it out. Try going to the room on the right and then come back. I'll be here waiting for you. Okay. See, I know, as you can see, it's just acting really stupid. Okay. You're doing great. Let's continue. Yeah, I'll just only go back and forth. <clears throat> the addition to the APs, you can also have money. You can see how much money you have on the top right of your screen, just under the APs. You can use monies to buy clothes and other things. You are given 15 every day when you log on. If you need more, go ahead to the bank. Go, you can always go to the bank. You can... Oh, uh, well, <laughs> that's pretty fast. Sometimes it's like that. Um, so I didn't read the other one. Sorry, guys. Okay. Do you understand how the money works? Yes, I do. Good. While we're on this topic of monies, my servants are f service are free. If you can give me a settle of one hundred dollars fee before any further, please. You, if you press sure and you go play pay, you're actually not gonna pay anything. So you can free feel free to click on that if you don't. You can click on that, but it's not going to go up and down, so don't worry. I'm just going to say, here, the money. Thank you very much. Now I can go shopping. The guy at the clothes shop is so cute. Now, nah, I'm just kidding. Keep your money. You're going to need it. Let's continue. Yep. Also in the right, top right corner of your screen, you can find your moral meter. You can raise horizon alone according to what you do in the game and the people you meet. Let's keep going for now. So up here is the moral, just where I'm going to highlight. Yeah, that one. Oh, shut up. Okay, like there. I forgot to highlight the M. Okay, let's continue. If your moral falls into zero, you'll be too depressed to go out, which doesn't make it easy to float. You'll need to... You need a day or two before you can go out again. Do you understand? So it's really important to keep your moral not into zero. Yes, I understand. Just wait. Um. Okay. Speaking of flirting, you're definitely going to meet some interesting boys around here. However, some things you need to know first. They all have their habits and routines. You'll find certain boys more easier, easily in certain areas. So like... Nathaniel in his room is doing a council room. Um, Cassio um, in the courtyard. Iris sometimes in the thing, and Ken around, just like, but mainly the hallway. Okay. Those are places that they prefer in general, but be careful, be careful not to go there too often. Also, some boys are easier to find than others, but not necessarily easier to flirt with. You follow me? Just wait, guys. Okay, I'm just doing something. I was just seeing stuff. 
Okay, um, yes, I follow you. So, do you see the bar on the, the you see the, do you see the bar right? To the right, see this one here? It's so pretty! That's the level meter. When you talk with boys, the bar will go up or down. The higher it is, the more boys, the, the more the boy likes you. On the other hand, the lower it goes, the less likely or more to win over. This is very important. Did you understand? Do you understand me? Um, yes, I understand. Great, let's put all in this into practice. Go into the room in the right and take a small talk with my friends of mine there. I'll wait for you here. Yep, it's Boris. Uh, I copy stuff reading his thing, so just say thanks. Okay, let's close this thing. Okay, back already? Uh, good, you catch on fast. See, you made a good impression on him. Okay. Anyways, at the end of an episode, you will need to assess to dates with the boys that you go along uh, you got along best with. So they're always different endings depending on the choice you make. Oh, come on. Okay. When you get a date, you you have to realize that the outcome isn't granted. You have to choose clothes that the boy will like and answer this, his question correctly. If you do well, your date will be with success. Do you, do you get it? Yes, I get it. Okay, I know all boys are great and all, but you need all kinds of other characters who are, who are not so nice. Anyone isn't like me, you know. He he he. I suggest that each episode you keep an eye for your aunt. She's a funny lady who's always ready to give you money, APs, or you need an exclusive clothes. Okay. What else do I need to tell you? Oh yeah, in the episodes you have missions to complete. For example, information you need to get, so don't hesitate to talk to a lot of people. You will also be asked to find certain objects. There are three possible ways to do that. Sometimes you could simply buy them at a store, get them from someone, or get, find them in a deco. You have to keep your eyes open. Do you understand? Yes. Uh, I don't think it will be too easy. Let's give this a try, okay? Go back to the room on the right, find a little structure that I made in art class, and then bring it back. Sorry about that noise. Okay, um... So basically, she got this elephant that she got here. As you can see, it's a bright thing. You haven't found it yet? Come on, try harder. Yes, I found it. It's a really easy to spin. Oh, come on. Hee <laughs> hee. I guess it wasn't too difficult. Let I'll let you have it if you want. You could put it in your room for decorations, but we're not done yet. I have more to tell you. Back to Shopee, I forgot to tell you. Not only can you buy clothes, there was also a jewelry store. The rings are super pretty and each one has a special power when you wear it. For example, if you wear a ring that makes it easier to find certain boys, the many different powers are explained to the description of the ring. You can see yourself for yourself. Personally, I like to collect them all. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. Good. And one last very important after I'm done. Okay. Listen closely. You have possibility to replay episodes. There are two ways to do that. Sorry, I'm just going to get a bit closer. With the story replay, you replay an episode of your choice with a into a clan with a scenario. You have replays in all episodes that follows episodes when you replay and obviously the story will occur. For example, if you wanna if you're in episode five you can decide to replay episode two. If you want if you will have to play and uh, replay episode three and four you have to get back to episode five. So the story play is always needs to news if you want to change your story. Otherwise, there's single episode replay. You could go back and replay any episodes without it having an effect on your story. This is this is the replay you should use if you want to try out different endings or try special objects, example, without changing your story.
Wait, etc. I mean, oh, oh well. Okay, of course, whichever replay you use, you will keep all your illustration of objects already collected. So that's all for replays. I know it sounds complicated, but don't hesitate to ask me repeat every to repeat anything. If you need me to, are you sure you understood everything? Okay, fantastic. So we're done. There's nothing else for me to teach you. So I'll let you get started the fun of my candy love with episode one. If you have any problems or questions, feel to go to the floor. I'm in this help section. See you later. Have a great game. Okay, so that's all for episode zero. It's all complicated and stuff, but if you want to check out again, you can. You're free. Welcome to. So we're starting in episode one, and I hope you have a great time. And I just I had to see you next Saturday, and I'm going to upload episode three. Thanks. Bye.